Okay, Sagittarius, these are just general messages. I've got a long week ahead of me with my son's birthday, so I just want to get these up and out for you guys. So Sagittarius, sun, moon, and rising. What messages do we have for Sagittarius? Sagittarius. Ooh, you're in the upright, Sag. That's good. We have the, um, we have the, uh, it's not a gecko, salamander, so there is some sort of transformation happening for you as well. I feel like it's a character transformation. I don't feel like it's like, you know, you're going out and getting a new haircut or, you know, a nose job or anything like that. Something you feel like you got left out of before is coming back around. Could be a relationship. You are... If you're not involved right now, you will be getting involved, okay? Sagittarius. Gomez, sir, you gotta get on me while I'm doing this. You wanna say hi, Gomez? You wanna say hi to Sagittarius? Ugh. No, Gomez was bought with a bad eye, guys. We did not poke his brain or anything. That's the way he came. And I think it makes him cuter. Okay. Sagittarius. Sagittarius, if this isn't a relationship, it could be like a business opportunity that, you know, didn't go well the first time and is coming back around and now they want to offer you something. But it looks like a relationship. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Oh, shit. Look at this. We have money coming through. Something you've been waiting for. This is not a small amount of money. What does that look like for Sagittarius? What does that look like? For some of you, it's going to be through marriage. Because I'm seeing people getting married. I'm seeing dogs as well. Someone speaking their truth. Somebody coming forward. So if it's work related, um, if this is like, you know, somebody coming forward with this large opportunity for you where you're going to make really good money, um, I feel like they could be older than you. They don't have to be. This person's a very like wise person, but they're not very flexible. I am getting Aries here. For others of you, this could be like a marriage you get involved with it create some sort of income for you. I'm getting Aries. And for others of you, um, you could just be getting a sugar daddy, sugar mama. I don't know. I don't know, guys. So I'll take that. I'm a Sag. I'm a Sag Moon. You can bring some money my way. I do see you kind of contemplating, though, once this income comes in, where are you going to invest it? What are you going to do with it? Um, you know, there's there's lots of options, and so I feel like you're kind of, this is a balancing act, right? Sagittarius, sun, moon, and rising. I'm getting, I'm getting red hair. I'm getting dark hair. I'm also getting, um, I'm getting somebody needing a haircut, guys. I see somebody bringing up your past to you and causing you some sort of um, upset as well. Something that you haven't thought about in a long time or hasn't affected you in a really long time. I also see you having a lot of passion, whether this is sex or whether this is just finding your passion again in the workforce. Um, I see that happening. But why is the Four of Wands in the reverse? Okay, so there's two ways this is going to go. Al, somebody brings up something from your past and it has to do with something you did, like, sexually. Whether you were being promiscuous or there was some weird acts or whatever, somebody could be bringing that up and it could cause you some sort of issues. For others of you, um, you could be having a fling, like a very short-term um, sexual encounter. Whether you're involved or not, it's saying this is going to happen, okay? It's just... You know, if if you're if you're monogamous, I would avoid this or getting yourself into anything like that. If you're not monogamous, hey, enjoy. I'm 
but be careful be careful okay when I say, especially for those of you going out and having a fling, because if you are involved with somebody or somebody has like love for you, they are now in the reverse and they're very upset. If this is um, a situation where you are not involved and you have a fling, this person's also very upset. They think, I think they were led astray. I feel like they thought there was going to be more to this than not. And they're coming out as fire sign, but it doesn't have to be, okay? Now, if this is work-related, Sag, if this is work-related and it's like, oh, you found passion, but like in the wrong, in the wrong kind of way, you know what? I'm not even going to go there because this is definitely like relationship-based. I'm seeing like penises everywhere, just flying in my face. Continue. I'm seeing a black cat. Why are you moving on bitterly, Sagittarius? Okay, so else you were looking at moving or you were looking at some sort of trip to bring you some sort of relief and that is not going to happen. And so you're just going to kind of have to leave it in the past. Okay, you're going to be like, well, you know, that opportunity is gone. Um, it could have, you know, it, it could have solved a lot of problems for you in your, like you think. I don't know whether it would or not, but but it doesn't end up happening and I feel like you're a little bit like upset about it bitter about it there's something coming Sag that you don't see as of now okay what is that what does Sag not see coming so an opportunity whether this is work related or a love connection somebody's going to be letting you go okay um you won't be getting messages from this person anymore this could be a client this could be um a loved one but they they realize that they were putting in too much effort and you weren't putting in enough um and it's done and over with or will be you don't see it coming so clearly it hasn't happened yet sagittarius why is the five of wands here Expecting an argument with it. They're coming out as a younger air sign doesn't have to be. Still contemplating a move here. You are. You're still. And you're also stalking somebody, Sad. What is up with that? And it doesn't mean like stalking, like going by their house. I mean, it's like you're watching somebody for whatever reason. You want to see what they're doing. This could be, you know, a client. This could be. Um, an, an X, you know, something like that. There's some sort of ego involved. I don't know if it's you or them, Sagittarius. Somebody wants to fight. It looks like you. It looks like you still want to put in some sort of effort somewhere. You're holding out your cup of, um, of, uh, you're watching a water sign, Sag. Why is that this? Who is this water sign? Because you're both looking at each other. They're coming at you with like care and concern and you're looking at them like in, in the dark. Like you don't want them to know. This person is working on their income. That's how you know it's them. It doesn't have to be a water sign. And they are going through some sort of self-care, self-help <clears throat> situation as well. I'm seeing, this is going to be really weird, but I'm seeing cooking mitts and, and burgers. So I feel like this person probably is Elsa Chef or somebody who likes to cook. Sagittarius, what else do they need to know? This person has been hurt by you before, so you do know who they are or you've been hurt by them before. What is the tower moment here for? You are going to have to make a decision, Sagittarius. You have two people here. 
um, the tower moment is that they both see you as like an end result and you are not um, focused on just one person. That's what I'm getting. If this does not sound like you, this could be the opposite. Your person is not focused on just you. They're focused on something else and it's going to cause a tower moment. Sagittarius. We do have the Ace of Cups here. <clears throat> For a restart, something new, something like emotionally fulfilling. What is that? Clarify why the Hierophant's here. Okay, it's a restart with somebody, it's a reconciliation, okay? I do have, I do have Taurus here and I do have Scorpio. Somebody's ready to invest. I don't feel like this is a very traditional situation here with the Hierophant in the reverse, but you know, with death, it's like you guys are willing to make the changes that are necessary um, and there's a lot of give and take here, but some sort of karmic justice as well. So somebody left the situation because they felt like they weren't getting what they needed and now they're coming back around. Okay. Money could be involved and I'm not really sure what that's about. about. <laughs> so this could be like a business partner as well. It doesn't have to be a romantic. For Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you are going to go through a period of time of being upset by whoever this person is. They are coming out as a water sign. It doesn't have to be. Um, and why? Why are you going through this? Okay, because um, it looks like you're going to see... Again, this could be opposite, guys. I'm not accusing you of anything. This could be, you know, this water sign is doing this. There's options here. Now, else you had options or they have options. And you're going to go through this period of time of being a little bit upset knowing they have a lot of options. Um, whether they're with you or not, they have a lot of options or vice versa. They're going to be very upset because they feel like you're still keeping options open. Anything else Saj needs to know? We do have a earth sign here. Heavy on the Capricorn. They make, make promises to you that they can't keep. So if this is like a business situation, because they are coming out with pentacles, um, just know that they're not going to actually make good on their word. If this is, for some reason, somebody that you are emotionally involved with or sexually involved with, again, they're going to make a lot of promises. Um, maybe they love bomb you, something like that, but they don't actually mean anything they say. <clears throat> This will cause you some sort of distress, okay? And again, I, for many of you, this is, like I said, it's work or, or client or business partner because we have the Ace of um, Pentacles in the reverse. So, you know, if somebody's telling you like, oh no, absolutely, like buy, invest, um, you're gonna get that raise, whatever, they're, they're lying, they're lying to you. Anything else Saj needs to know, and I'll end it here. Have some sort of imbalance. Trying your best to heal from something that happened. Being judged harshly, again, looks like a water sign. Heavy on the Pisces doesn't have to be. They will be coming in with a message from you. It is possible you two meet here, and it looks like travel plans. You do have somebody, it looks like a family member, doesn't have to be, that is going to be falling ill this summer. All right. And I see somebody leaving the situation because they feel like you were being dishonest with them or... Um, 
with the seven of swords they feel like you you did something behind their back or something like that okay um yeah i do see a manifestation happening for you though guys so whatever that manifestation is i think that'll be right around the corner so all right Saj, i hope this helps